Greenlee Gator hydraulic battery cutters, uh, both capable of working with soft materials and hard materials. Um, just want to do a quick recap on the whole line here. We have a representative set of these tools in front of us here, our hard metal cutters and our soft metal cutters. Uh, one of the things we wanted to really kind of uh, focus on during this video is the weight to cutting capacity that these tools have. And that's a big thing that we focus on here at Greenly. Uh, ultimately, from a weight perspective, we want to make sure that we have the least amount of weight that you're going to be holding above your head or uh, down towards the ground. Um, but at the same time, we want to have a large capacity. Uh, to satisfy a wide range of cutting materials. And we have two examples here that really, really focus on that. Uh, the first of which is our ESC50 soft metal cutter for aluminum and copper. This has a 7.2 pound weight to it, along with a two inch cutting capacity, which is phenomenal uh, in the industry as it relates to overall weight to cutting capacity. On our hard metal line, uh, we have our ESG25. Our ESG25 can go up to 636 ACSR. It can go through uh, half inch EHS uh, guy wire as well. A um, little bit of variety that goes along with these tools uh, is associated with uh, a couple of the features that we've really taken from the industry and incorporated into the tools in and of themselves. One of them would be the fact that when we're working with hard materials, uh, typically we're going to break some blades uh, in terms of whether a user puts the tool uh, around a piece of a hard metal material that's too much of a capacity for that, um, or if the tools just basically run through its life cycle of the blades. We now can be field replaceable with a lot of our blades uh, in the tools. Uh, another very important aspect of these tools is that they have an electronic break. So what I mean with that is when I'm putting some glasses on here, is that when we activate these tools, when I let go of the trigger, they immediately stop. There's no residual travel that comes along with these tools. So residual travel is not a good thing when you're working with a battery hydraulic tool that has a massive amount of force uh, behind it, uh, predicated upon the hy hydraulic nature of the tool in and of itself. Um, a couple other things that we've incorporated into these tools, our tools are capable of having multiple personalities. Uh, and what I mean by that is we can program different profiles into them to make them act a little bit differently. A couple of those features that we've worked into some of our tools are a double tap trigger mechanism. As you can see, when I pull the trigger down on this tool, it doesn't do anything. But when I double tap it, you get activation. So it's one of those safety features that we have available on all of our cutters. We also have the ability to, uh, with select cutters, uh, to make them remote control for situations where the user is not going to be around where, when you're prospectively cutting through a material. So really, really unique, really, really smart tools. Uh, the weight ratio on these tools is fantastic. Um, it just gives the user more choices for those specific use applications. The Greenlee Gator hydraulic battery tool cutting line.